Fruitful Station is a very tragic film when you look at the grand scheme of things. But it's very entertaining. It tells the story of Oscar Grant in the last day of his life. And I think this movie could teach a lot of young people a lot of important messages. If you've never seen this film, I, I highly recommend it. Based on a true story, Fruit Fill Station depicts the last day of life of Oscar Grant before he was fairly shot at the Fruit Fill Bart Station in Oakland. This film stars Michael B. Jordan, Melina Diaz, Chad Michael Murray, and Octavia Spencer. And I have to say that these actors did such a great job for this film, especially Michael B. Jordan. He knocked out the part once again with his amazing performance. And the fact that this is based on a true story makes it the all more tragic. When you look at this was a young man who lost his life at such a young age. He was a son. He was a father. And Michael B. Jordan plays that pretty well. I've always been a fan of his movies. And this, I believe, is one of his stronger films he's pretty much ever been. Even in films that were bad, he always s seems to stand out. And you really get what kind of person Oscar was. He was a caring father, son. He was trying to make ends meet. He made some mistakes before in the past, being locked up and all that. But I think where this situation comes is how unfortunate these events happened that led to his death. And it shows that police brutality is still a major problem in today's society, especially here in America, because we've seen many young black men die of stupid circumstances, and it just doesn't change the fact uh, how unfair it is sometimes to be a young black man in America. This film could teach people a lot of things. It's clearly some racism in this film. And it stands as one of the films I believe is underrated. I know a lot of people like this film. But I don't think everyone gives this film much credit as it is. I enjoy this movie. It's a very entertaining film. And the way it ends is just tragic all around. If there's anything really negative I have to say about this film, it's that it's too short. It should have been longer. We should have explored more of Oscar's backstory. And they should have looked into his situation when he was in jail. We didn't get enough of that in this film. But Michael B. Jordan plays his character so well, you forget his short miscomings here. Not only that, but I tell you, Spencer, she's just a great actress all around, playing the mother of Oscar. And her performance at the end of the film, it just, it's Oscar worthy. The way the emotion she shows on her face, and you really feel for her. Especially, you know, it's one of the sad scenes in the film. This was a young man who died at such a young age, and he didn't really get justice for his unfortunate. It's unfortunate shooting. It just shows how not everything is black and white, and there's still a lot of racial tensions in the world today. This film just screams just, oh, it was one of the best films of 2013. I have to agree with that. It actually won an award for best film at some award show, and that just speaks volumes. Once again, check this film out if you haven't already. I'm giving this film an AI 10. Thoroughly enjoyable, especially if you like stories based on real life. Then you will have a good time here. It's just the film is sad towards the end. And everything about this film was great in my opinion. I enjoyed the acting. The story could have been a little bit more tweaked in, in terms of showing the best story of Oscar. And this film is funny on some parts, but other than that, I think the real message here is that b being a black male or even female, it could be difficult living in America, especially 
when there are possibly some racist cops out there. But other than that, I think this film can teach a lot of messages about how we all need to come together in times of unfortunate, you know, unfortunate deaths of young people. And that's my review of Fruitville Station. Okay, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about this film. Is it one of your personal favorites of 2013? And also let me know what is your favorite film of all time that involves a form of racism or a situation similar to this film. Interesting film. It's very well liked by a lot of people. And Michael B. Jordan just turns in an amazing performance here. Seriously, he's like one of the best actors in Hollywood. Alright, this is Slim Guy 172 saying peace out.